Welcome to OS University video explainer on how to get whitelisted in order to participate in the EDU token sale. To start, click Get Whitelisted on the top right of your screen. This will lead you to OS University whitelist page where you need to go through two main steps. Step one is to start the certification process that is managed by PyCOPS Parity ICO Passport Service. Click Start Certification, which is the blue button that you see on the screen. Then choose your country of citizenship. Only non-US citizens will be allowed to take part in the campaign, so you need to click on the world map. Then you need to select your country of citizenship from the drop-down menu. Simply enter the name of your country and proceed ahead. Once you do so, you need to confirm that you're in possession of one of these documents, a passport, a national identity card or a driving license. You also need to confirm that this document is not expired. When you confirm, by clicking on the checkbox, you need to continue by clicking the blue button. Now you need to pay a small certification fee to PyCOPS Passport Service by sending 0.024 ETHERS to the address you see on this screen. To send this amount you need to access your ETHER wallet. In the case of the video explainer we are accessing our ETHER wallet from myeterwallet.com. As long as you use such online services, remember to make sure that you are using legitimate valid website with valid and legitimate certificates. In the case of myeterwallet.com, you need to click Send Eater and Tokens from the main navigation menu and you need to select one of the options to access your wallet. We select Key Store and we actually proceed with selecting our wallet file. When we do so, we need to enter the password to our wallet in order to unlock it. When our Ether wallet is unlocked, we can go back to the whitelist page, copy the address to which the certification fee is going to be sent. You paste the address in the transaction form. You enter the amount of 0.024 ETHER. You set the gas limit at appropriate levels so that the transaction can be executed quickly. You click Generate Transaction and you click Send Transaction. The transaction needs to be confirmed and will instantly be broadcasted to the network. It will be mined and confirmed in just a few seconds. In our case, we used a gas limit of 21,000, which is sufficient. To see that this transaction with which we paid the certification fee is confirmed, you can go back to the whitelist page where this message awaits you. Certification fee has successfully been received. Now you need to proceed with the actual validation of your Ether wallet and your identity. To do so, you need to click the third option that you see on the screen. This option states, I wish to certify my own existing wallet. In this new box, you need to enter your Ether address from which you are going to be sending ETHERS in order to buy ED tokens. So you copy your ETHER wallet address, you paste it in the form, you click NEXT and in just a few seconds your order will be processed. When processed you are going 
to need to enter your personal details. This means that you need to enter your surname, your given names and confirm your country of citizenship the exact same way they appear in your identity document you're going to use for the validation of your identity. For best results, of course, you need to submit a high-quality, sharp image of your passport or your identity card or your driving license. You click Next when you enter your name. And now is the moment that you need to upload into the validation and verification service a copy of your identity card or passport. In our case, we will upload the front and the back of a identity card. You start by uploading and confirming the upload of the front of your identity card. Then you need to upload a photo of the back of your identity card and you need to confirm this upload as well. Congratulations, your documents have been uploaded and in just a few seconds the process of the validation of your personal information will start. This process of identity, validation and certification of the wallet which you are going to use to buy your EDU tokens can take from a few minutes to a few hours depending on the number of people that are trying to certify at the same time. Don't worry, in 99% of the cases it takes about 10 to 15 minutes. But if the process takes too long, you can simply check where you are in terms of completion of this transaction by using Etherscan. The way you are going to make sure that your identity certification is completed is by watching the left side of the screen. Under certifying your identity, you can see the address of your Ether wallet that you are currently certifying. This address is currently in grey. Once it is certified, it will turn green. As you can see, it is not yet certified and this is clearly indicated. Suddenly it becomes green, so congratulations, your Ether wallet address has been certified, your identity has been verified. Now you only need to close step 2, entering once more and once final time your personal information details. You, enter, you need to enter them once more so that we can match you with the profile you just certified through PyCOPS service. So you enter your surname, you enter your given names and you enter your country of citizenship. Of course, the data needs to match the same that you just used. And remember, only whitelisted transactions will be accepted by our EDU tokens smart contract. In order to be fully compliant with all, with all regulations that exist in the field of KYC procedures or Know Your Customer procedures, we also ask you to enter your email address. All your personal details are safely encrypted and stored on the blockchain so you don't need to worry about your identity verification process as long as you're entering the right information. 
Finally, you need to confirm that you have read and agree with the white paper and with the terms and conditions documents. You need to declare that you are not a US citizen and there is nothing more than to click finish whitelisting. Congratulations, you have been whitelisted and now you can safely take part in the EDU token sale. How to do so you will find in another video. For now, thank you for watching.